Hi, I'm Dan Chung with Atomos, and I'm here today to walk you through the latest announcement, announcements from us at NAB 2019. And uh, our biggest announcement of the show is this, the Shogun 7, our latest and greatest production monitor, recorder, and now switcher, all in one nice little seven inch package. Uh, it has what we claim to be the absolute best production monitor, small production monitor screen on the planet. Why do we say that? Because it takes all the screen technology that we, we know about and all, all our color science that we have, we've built for years and then combines it with a new technology that is backlighting. So you've got 360 zoned backlights that allow you to have this incredibly incredible picture, which you can see here, which has got really detailed blacks, not just deep blacks, but detailed blacks, and also highly detailed highlights with super rich color. I don't really need to explain it. You can see it right there for yourself. Well, if, if you were standing here in person, you can see it here for yourself. Maybe a bit harder to see on camera, but we really do think that is, is the best you can get. And what's the point of having that on a, cam a monitor like this? Well, all those latest televisions that you get at home, the HDR, Dolby Vision approved televisions, um, are gonna have pictures that are not dissimilar like that. So if you're shooting, you need to be shooting on something that's very similar to what you're gonna be watching at home. You know, and you can always go downwards. So if you're shooting and editing for you know, 709, um, you can always dial it back. But what you can't do is dial it in if it doesn't exist. So you need to be able to see it in its true beauty right here on screen from the get-go so you know what you're gonna be able to get on those amazing screens. Um, in addition to that, what we've done is we've added in, and I can't show you on here because this is um, a pre-production model, but what we've got is the switching function. The, there are four SDI, HDSDI inputs in here, and just like our Sumo 19, you'll now be able to switch between those four HDSDI inputs, record all of them, and then record monitor ta um, cut tags and cuts as you go and output that live or and record it as a fifth stream. So you get your four uh, ISO recordings plus the program out also recorded. So that's an amazing function and it's also asynchronous and that's the new bit for the Sumo 19 as well. So if you've got a Sumo 19, you'll be gaining this as a free function, as a, as a free firmware upgrade, but, oh, Atom OS upgrade. Um, but before, the, the, the SDI sources needed to be synced to Genlocked. Now they don't need to be. Now you can have four independent sources and they will all just record perfectly. Now, in addition to the monitoring and the switching, we've also got all the recording that you're used to getting in the Shogun Inferno. So that's ProRes RAW and ProRes DNX HD, HR, and um, also uh, um, uh, Cinema DNG. So all those formats will still be in here, up to 5.7K if you've got a Panasonic EVA-1, um, and you've also got the high-speed HD 240s on cameras like the FS5. So an amazing uh, recording device as well and all packaged together. And then the last thing to mention about the Shogun 7 is it also has Dolby Vision Live output. Now that's an incredible new feature. We've worked with Dolby, uh, we've partnered with Dolby to make that available to anybody buying the Shogun 7 or the Ninja 5, and you'll be able to live play out any raw or log footage as Dolby Vision or into a Dolby Vision television. Um, so the idea of this is if you're working on a uh, a Netflix or an Amazon big production at the, at the high end, you'll be able to just literally play your rushes back and see them or even connect live and see it, see the full range of the image as displayed as best as possible on a state-of-the-art television straight out of this. Um, if you want to use it for monitoring um, in, on set, if you're on a low-end production, you're not going for a Dolby Vision finish, you're still going to be, see, be able to see the maximum amount of, of image on that screen at once. And that's the big difference. You can see everything at once. So before, we, yes, we had, we had Atom HDR, but that allowed you to only see essentially the bottom end or the top end of the image. You couldn't see both ends of the image at the same time. If I look at something now, I'm gonna get the whole range. I'm gonna get 15 plus stops of dynamic range shown at the same time. So right down into the blacks, right up to the shadows, they're all gonna be shown on screen. And that's very similar when you output it on HDMI to a Dolby Vision television. Again, you're gonna be able to see those full 15 stops. And okay, so you might not get that exact same result of your grading in seven. You definitely won't get that same result if you're gonna go for a 709 finish, but at least you can see what the sensor and the camera is capable of all in the one go. So 
that's it. That's the Shogun 7. So thanks for watching. And um, if you want to know any more about any of these products, just head over to the Atomos website. That's www.atomos.com, where there's all the info will be there and some great user case studies as well.